Hey everyone, it's Kyrie. Just coming on to give an update. So, little one here is asleep, but I thought I'd show you how cute she looks. She snuggled up in her blanket and like tossed and turned until she was completely wrapped up and then fell asleep. So, I'm standing right here. I'm gonna see if my knees. Right there, so, and I'm this close, and I got her, but I'm letting her sleep this way for a while at least. It's, it's getting late, and I don't want to wake her up again. <laughs> so, um, let's see. The first update would have to be um, when Kiyomi's going to be home. Kiyomi will be home. On my birthday, on December 11th. And I am so excited. I can't wait for my birthday to come. It's like, so exciting. It's going to be like the best birthday ever, I think, because I'm going to be getting her home at that time. Uh, let's see. For work, I still haven't found a full-time job or even a part-time, but I am going to be working for Marie Calendars for Thanksgiving. So from the 21st to the 28th, I'll be working probably every single day. And, um, hopefully I'll be able to get kept on after that because she said that if anybody gets kept on, I will be the top to be kept on, and so I'm really excited about it and hoping that it works out because that would be just great and I think that's about it for right now um, not much has changed and I've been really busy lately with being able to drive everywhere as um, made me able to do a lot more things throughout my days and, um, get things taken care of. So that's been nice to make, um, finding a job a little bit easier. If Marie Calendars doesn't work, I'm gonna go back to, um, Go back to looking at nanny jobs again. So I can at least save money. But it's been going okay. Um, things at home aren't the greatest, but that's okay. Um, I think with the holidays coming up, it might get a little easier. Maybe, maybe not. It might become a little bit more stressful. Who knows? Nova has been... A terror. Oh my god. She's getting into everything. She's getting on everything. She has now figured out that she can get on my mom's bed. On to her desk. From being on the bed. And then up to the very top shelf. That I can barely reach. Unless I'm on my, like, my tippy toes. Because she's on the desk. And I came home today, and she had destroyed my mom's cap and gown from her graduation. And boy, did I give it to her for that. And she also had started getting down mom's beanie bears from her weight loss. So those are very special, you know? Um, so she was put in her kennel for a while because she wouldn't... Behave. So that's another thing that's been keeping me busy. <laughs> it's like having a toddler. I swear, it's almost worse. <laughs> but yeah, kind of an update, and I really wanted to show you guys how cute she was. And as you can see, I like a lot of blankets on my bed. <laughs> My heater, um, 
the heater doesn't work in my room, so this little white heater right here, um, and excuse my nails, I can use that during the day, but at night I have to turn it off because it gets really hot, and, um, I can't risk, you know, it, ha it catching on fire from being too hot or something. So, I think that'll be it now. Let's see. I mean, we were watching Auntie Toledo Girl, and that is why, and she fell asleep watching, or well, listening to Toledo Girl. So, shout out to her. We miss you. You know, you haven't been talking much, so. We will be back on soon. Bye.